Welcome. This story is about a 19-year-old single mom who works at Brooks Diner named Mia. This talks about how Mia becomes a real comes like kind of rich to poor. It talks all about it. So, let's get started. 5:30 in the morning. Beep. 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 I'm up. Let me turn the light on. Oh, I gotta be quiet. Louis stay asleep. Time to get ready for work. I need to get my uniform on. Wrong uniform. There we go. Now let me fix my hair up. I think I'll go with this one for today. There we go. Now time to brush my teeth. And I'm going to brush up my hair a little bit more. There we go. Now time to go get a bottle for Lily and then... Well, I have one right here. I almost forgot. And I'm just going to warm it up real quickly. And the bottle maker right there. Warms it up. Okay, now time to give, time to wake her up and give it to her and then go to work. Good morning, Lily. Good morning, Lily. I know you're tired, sweetie. So is Mommy. But here's your bottle. See, it's really the bottle. Okay, let's get you in the car and then let's get Mommy something to have for breakfast while we get there. Let me turn on the lights first. You know, I'm just going to stop at Starbucks on the way there. So then we can just get in the car and stop at... Well, drop her off and then stop at Starbucks. And then we can... Then I'll go to work. Oh, wait, we need to go downstairs. Because the car is down there. Good thing my boss lets me come in at any time. Puts Lily in the back. Okay, let's go now. So it's right by the daycare, so I'm gonna go here first. What? Sorry, I was talking to my mom in real life, guys. Okay. I'm just gonna leave her in the car real quick. It's real quick. It should be fine. Let me get my money out. Ah, one card. (coughs) 
Hello, yes, I would like a breakfast sandwich and a pink drink. Um, no, no, a coffee, yeah. Please. Oh, I can just grab it? Okay, thanks. Oops, I did not mean to grab the pink drink, but I forgot. Coffee and sandwich. Now I need to go drop Lily off. Good thing her school is right here. Well, daycare. Well, my shift starts at 12 o'clock, actually. I don't actually get to pick it. So, I'll be quick. Get slowly. Okay, Lily. Let me sit you down in the little baby area over here. Went to the wrong area. Okay, goodbye, Lily. Let me go pay. Yes, I'm just dropping off my daughter, Lily. Here is my credit card. And thank you, goodbye. Okay, I'm gonna be a little late, but my boss won't be mad. Let's park. Such a bad driver. Okay, I'm here. <clears throat> hey boss, I'm here. I'm sorry a few minutes late. I had to drop off my daughter and I had to get breakfast on the way. Oh yeah, it's okay. Okay, my shift is only two. Four o'clock, so that's good. Well, no, three o'clock. Today it's from three o'clock because he let me go in at twelve o'clock and I always get out at three o'clock. So I'm just gonna see what people need me to do. Now it is 3.12, so let's leave. Time to go get my daughter. Oh, Hello, yes, I'm here to get my daughter. What's her name? Uh, her name is Lily. Yep, Lily. Okay, let me get my credit card out. There you go. Excuse me. Hi, Lily. Let's go home, baby. Places Lily in the back. Home and sees cops. Yes, hello, officers. What's the problem? 
worry about my house? Uh, well, the problem is that your house was just robbed. And there's no longer any furniture and no more money and everything's gone. But that's all the money I have. Oh. I'm so sorry. Um, you can stay with us for a day, but... And then we can try to find you somewhere else, but if we can't find you anywhere else, then... I'm sorry, then you'll have to be on the streets, if not. Yeah, I guess I'll go with you for the day. Gets a call from the boss. Yes, hello. Uh, you can get in, ma'am. Okay, I'll get in the back. Drives there. They drive there. Yeah, gets a call from the boss. Yes, hello, Mia. You are being fired because you gave someone a steak that was raw. No, I didn't. Well, yes, you did because they just got food poisoning and died. Well, they didn't die, but they got sick and they got food poisoning. So I'm afraid I have to let you go. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Oh, dang. Any way of getting money now. <laughs> and I don't have money for my daughter's daycare even. Oh my gosh. Okay, you can just stay uh, in one of the jail cell rooms. That's the only place that we have for today. I'll try to find you somewhere for tomorrow, though. But if I can't, then you'll have to be on the streets. I'm sorry. It's okay. Here's this room. You can go in here. Well, Lily, this is where we're gonna be staying for the night. <laughs> oh, also, we may as well take your phone while we're here, because we know you're not gonna be able to have it. And the police is here about to take it with in your credit card. Oh, okay, here's my phone. Here's my credit card. That's everything I own. <sighs> These beds don't look that great. I'm just gonna lay on the ground. Good night, honey. I love you. <coughs> I fall asleep randomly at 1 a.m. An officer comes in. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Oh, hi, officer. W what's up? W what do you need? Uh, oh, ma'am, we uh, found you a place to stay. Why don't you come with me? Oh my gosh, thank you so much. We don't have anything for you, though. There might be stuff in the house. Oh, that would still help so much. So, where's the place? Well, let me come show you. Oh, no, wait, this is the wrong way. Well, this is it. I'm sorry about this. This is the best we could do. No, this helps so much. Thank you so much. 
I don't know how to even explain it. <sighs> Thank you. You're welcome. Goodbye. Well, let's go take a look at us, I guess. Oh, this is really bad. When he went, he said the best he could do. He really meant the best he could do. So it is really not great. Let's see if the TV works at least. <gasps> I finally have a working TV. He said this house is free too. Because it's abandoned. At least there's some food here, I guess. Well, this is the only room it looks like. Oh, and there's baby stuff too, so that's good. Phew, there's a baby crib. Well, since I got fired, I'm gonna see if there's any place I can work, but I have to take my daughter with me now, since she doesn't have a daycare now. Looks like we're gonna have to walk, Lily. Well, let's check out the backyard, too. Before we leave. <clears throat> it's probably not gonna be good. Well, at least it came with a pool, I guess. Like, you can put a pool in. And the officers put it in for me, so that's good, I guess. Wakes up from dream. Oh, I really do wish there was a pool here, actually. But, there's not one. It's a lot more, though. This is bad. Whatever though. Okay, now time for me to go look for a job. Okay, let's walk there. Well, try to find a job walking somewhere. I'm gonna try the daycare because then I can have people watching my daughter while I work there. I hope they say yes. Hello, daycare, can I work for you? Oh, yes, oh my god, thank you so much. You're currently poor and I don't have any money. <laughs> And it really means a lot. What I mean by really is really. Because life is rough right now. So. Thank you so much. While I, while I uh, do this, can I place my baby down while I work here? Yes. Okay. Thank you so much. There you go. Now I'm gonna watch some kids up here. Okay guys, so, um, I might do a part two, but right now I don't feel like doing anything else, and I just got stuck up there, okay. Right now I don't feel like doing anything else, and this was really good and stuff but you know i'm not gonna do a part two like basically the moral of the story is at the end 
at the end, Mia and her baby have a good life, and this job pays her well, and they get a new, really good house, and their life turns out great, and yeah, I don't feel like doing the rest, because it's going to be a super long video and stuff, but that's basically what happened, so... I hope you enjoyed what I did in this, and have a great day, and bye! Thank you so much for watching.